Do I have any hidden talents? Hmm. You know, I'm actually a really good rapper. You never think this, but like, they'd be like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, if I could meet any three people who were dead or alive, I would meet Beyonce, Marilyn Monroe, and probably Kanye West, or Ye. If I were stranded on an island that could only take three objects, I would bring, oh my God, this is so hard. I would bring toothbrush for sure. But that requires toothpaste, so that, that takes two out of it. You know what I mean? If you're on an island, like, okay, hold on. I would bring a computer. <laughs> I need a charger. <laughs> okay. <laughs> my cell phone. I need a charger for it too as well. Mother. Bless you. And water. You need a lighter. I would give my past self um, the advice of, you know, to keep going, to not let anything stop you and to focus. The advice I give to a person trying to pursue social media is I would tell them to be able to develop their brand. They need to discover who they are, what they represent. From there, I would tell them to, once they you know decide their brand, to really um, focus on you know putting out the content that you know their audience would like. My most embarrassing moment. Oof, there's so many. I don't even know. I don't even know. Like, I, I, I think I've had so many bad and embarrassing moments in my life that I've just made so many videos on it. So watch my YouTube or Instagram because that's usually why. Um, I think the one thing that my fans maybe don't know about me that um, I wish they did was that I'm really a lot goofier and nicer than I look. I think that my face gives off resting face when I'm really just need to rest. And my biggest pet peeve is literally people whose ego is bigger literally than their frigging, than I don't even know, countries, I don't care. I Get over yourself, like, ugh, be humble, sit down. <sighs> the first creators that I followed on social media were, shoot, Rihanna, um, Lady Gaga, for sure, um, and I think Beyonce. Mm -hmm. If I had to describe my word myself in four words, I would describe myself the best person ever. Is that right? Which people's accounts do I follow on social media? Um, I really like this like weird like styling page that like gives you hacks on like how to do things. And then Jess Hunt because she's gorgeous and she just looks like literally like aesthetically everything's perfect. Shout out Jess Hunt. Okay. And um, funny pages like like what's it called? Um, um, Kaylee, what is it called? The the funny Instagram that we follow? Saint Hoax and Saint Hoax. They're hilarious. Okay, sorry. I'm, I'm doing an interview. I just like forgot the name of it. <laughs> Bye. Saint Hoax. My role models are definitely my mother. My mom is like my biggest role model of all time. She's not only a huge feminist and woman activist, but she also, you know, changed the name for rock and roll history. I mean, it was always known as the boys club or game or something like that until she kind of stepped into it. She just taught me so much and she's definitely my biggest role model. My favorite holiday is definitely Christmas because me and my family all get together and like my nieces are so cute. They get in their little pajamas and Santa Claus comes. What's better than Santa Claus? If I could go anywhere in the world right now, I would go to Bora Bora because I've never been there and I just want to float on the water and just be able to jump out of my, you know, bedroom right there and be like, oh, hey guys, I'm peace, peace out. Get a tan, there's nothing better than that. Done, cut. Thank you guys, I'm Hannah Geraldo by the way. Peace out. Thanks guys, love you.